Hello, my name's Professor Harold Friedman and today we're going to be exploring the fascinating world of data mining. But first, a few questions. Do you remember that advert you saw this morning? Do you share your information online? Hello? No, I'm sorry. Have you ever been the victim of cold calling? Do you have an Oyster card? Are you signed up to a mortgage or a credit card? Yes, no, no. Are you played by junk mail? If so, then you are part of the data mining system. Now, let's explore the means by which your personal information is mined and processed. Now we'll look at the data mining cycle. Once the raw information has been extracted, it undergoes basic processing in order to remove anomalous data. This information is then broken down and further processed. The processed information is refined and distilled, eventually producing a more concentrated form of information. This concentrated information is now cross-referenced for quality, value and accuracy against other information. This commodified data is then distributed and sold to various industries, principally the media, marketing and advertising services. This information is used to target specific demographics and individuals with accurate marketing and advertising. Ever more accurate and effective targeted advertisements and marketing promotes consumerism and drives the demand for personal information. Modern advertising and data mining is a far cry from its humble beginnings. However, modern methods are far subtler and create less damage to the environment. Modern methods even help promote key areas of the brain. Tell him I'm dead. I'm not really dead. Once the data has been mined, it is then refined and processed. Some information is publicly available. Other parts must be combined to create value. Whilst there is some opposition to the data mining industry, most notably the No to Data Mining campaign, No to Data Mining! No! Stop data mining and corporate databases! The industry continues to grow. It's a prosperous industry providing people like me with a stable job. But you've got nothing to fear. After all, you've got nothing to hide, have you? On behalf of the National Data Mining Association and the entire data mining industry, thanks for watching. And remember, be safe. Don't divulge your information to anyone except for a certified data miner.